seriously? Still with this shit internet? Son of a bitch, dude, again. Fuck. Alright, well, I don't know what is up with my internet, man. I really don't know what's going on with my internet lately, dude. I, I don't understand it. I'm so fucking confused. I gotta get Comcast back out here again, dude. God damn it. What up, Jex? What up, Bounty? What's up, Curvy? God damn it, dude. They fucking, they were just out here, man. Why is it all fucked up again, dude? I'll try to reset my modem again tonight. See if that does anything for me. Which I know it won't, because I just did it, but... Oh boy. Alright. It has been a fucking brutal couple of days here, man. Holy hell. Let's do, uh. Let's go for Nightfall. Let's go for, like, an actual Nightfall run. It has been bad. God damn, dude. It's, it's, dude. I, I need a vacation, guys. I really do. I, I need a vacation from everything, from life. Like, I need to just, like, not do anything for, like, a couple weeks, man. It, it's just everything, man. Like, life is fucking doing me in. I got all this bullshit I gotta deal with that's going on in Connecticut now. I got fucking personal shit going on. I'm just, I'm just wore out, dude. I'm fucking wore out. I'm, I'm literally on like my last thread here, dude. Mentally, physically, everything. I'm I'm literally on my last fucking thread. Like it's bad. Um, Connecticut's about to get destroyed. Um, as far as like vaping goes, uh, which really sucks. Like they're about to get rid of it. Um, there's like a bunch of personal shit that I'm not gonna get into, but a bunch of personal shit going on, man. It's just uh, it's just bad. It, it's it's all bad right now. Like no joke, it, it's it's all bad. I was in a super good mood today up until like the last couple hours. Uh, this is the map known as Nightfall. Probably one of the best maps for Extinction, next to uh, Point of Contact. I love Point of Contact, but Extinction is what's up. And, like, I feel like I'm the only person in Connecticut who's actually trying to do something out here. Like, everybody else is just, like, sitting around doing nothing. Like, I'm trying to get the word out there, and people are just, like... And, and what pisses me off is it's, like, people that are in the community, like... And they, they don't even know what's going on. Um... And it, it, and it really, it really fucking... It, 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 it's just killing me, dude. Like there's people out there that are like big names in Connecticut, and they and I and I'm the one telling them to like send these emails out and shit. It's like, dude, really? Like even you guys don't know what's going on. Like this is fucking terrible, dude. It's just it's killing me. That that's my big stressor today because we've got like a couple days to try to make moves until we get royally effed in the A. Um, the only the only good thing that came out of today. 
is that oh another locker key is that I found out that my scoundrel is gonna be here Thursday with all with all luck and that's the one thing that's gonna come out of this week that's good um, as well as I might be going out on Friday to see a friend of mine that I haven't seen in fucking like five years um, to go see it which will be like super nice to just like not deal with nothing all week um, oh, speaking of which, I've actually got to shoot. Alright. Um... It's there. It, there, it, there's a lot of answers to that. Uh, number one is, you know, is obviously big tobacco, um, kind of pressuring them. Uh, they're raising the cigarette tax again, but by a very, very little amount. It's like thirty-five cents. Um, I guess the the Connecticut state budget is not very good right now, and they're trying to increase the budget. And so they are raising the cigarette tax by about 35%, um, or by 35 cents, I should say, I'm sorry. Um, and they are adding a vape tax, a wholesale tax, to all vapor products um, that is 75%. So if you are buying juice that's $25 a bottle, it's now going to be like $42, $43 a bottle, which is crazy. Um, it, it, it's it's gonna shut down an incredible amount of businesses. It's gonna put a lot of people out of work. Um, a lot of people that I consider friends. It's gonna put them out of work. It's gonna make them lose their their businesses, their jobs, their 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 way of living. Um, and it's just it's 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 crazy, dude. It's it's absolutely crazy. Um, and it really seems like a lot of people in the state don't even know that it's going on. Um, which is fucking killing me. Alright, let's go get this one done. Let's just go boogie upstairs. So I'm trying to get people to send out these emails. Like you guys can do it too. It literally takes like two seconds. You just have to put in a Connecticut area code. Um, you can even fill in like a fake name. You can put in like whatever, and it automatically writes up an email. And then you just hit the send button, and you're done. Um, it literally takes a minute. So if any of you guys can do that, it would be fucking phenomenal. Um, I've got about 50 emails sent out today from various people. Um, I'm basically, I'm just trying to get as many emails out as I can. The, the more people that send emails, the more they see that that many people are going to be unhappy with it. And it, it, like, it doesn't matter who it is. Um, so... Yeah, I hope so, Israel. I fucking hope so. But yeah, it's it's uh it's 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 not good right now, dude. I'm just I'm super super stressed out from it, man. I really am. And I'm not I'm not stressed out about my own money. I'm I'm really stressed out about all my friends that I've made and all these friends that I have that are gonna be without a job overnight. And the fact that they announced this on Sunday and they they're like gonna be making a decision like in the next two days. So, these people, literally, their entire lives are going to get flipped upside down in the course of about two or three days. And there isn't enough that they can do. And that's, that's what really kills me. Is that there is, there, like, there is, all you can really do is send these emails and, and voice your opinion, make the phone calls. And that's really it. There's not, like... That we, you know, you can't really. I mean, I'm, I'm legit about to like organize a protest. Like, I don't even care, dude. Like, I, I ooh, a vector though. I'm taking it. It's different. Um, 
you know, I I wish that there was more that we could do. Um, it's it's just it's 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 super stressful is what it is it's it's really super stressful to know that it could like all be gone like tomorrow um i mean it, it won't it, it won't be gone in the sense that like you can't have it it's illegal but you know these people that ha you know i've got i've got friends who have dumped their entire life savings into opening up a shop and it's it's all that they have and then that's going to be taken away from them and that's and that's really that's really fucked up you know what i mean um like it's really really fucked up so i don't know Well, that's hey, what a boot. Well, that's that's the thing, man. Is that they don't they don't really care. Um, that's part of our governor's problem. Is they really don't care. They just want to make their money. Um, they they don't care where it comes from, and 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 the thing that's really screwed up is that they're not they're not thinking about it logically. Um, you know, if they increase the taxes by seventy five percent, and they shut down all of these shops and all of these businesses, that. The, the income is gone the, they're not making any money off of it you know I, I i left a couple messages with uh with the governor's office and i was like listen why not like if you guys feel like you must tax us why not do like five percent that's a reasonable number where people will continuously be feeding you money they'll continuously be buying stuff from shops locally and you guys will keep gaining your money for the next two years you know, if you hit us with 75%, you're going to make a couple dollars of people who are buying emergency shit to get them through until their online orders come in. But you're going to be basically, you're basically going to get like a couple days worth of money and then it's all going to go away. You're going to, you're not going to make a dollar. So why not do like 5% or maybe 10% if you want to go nuts and actually continuously make money. And I guess they're they don't see it that way. They just see it as people will pay. They don't care. We're gonna make our money, and that's it. And it it's it's really really fucked up. It's 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 really screwed up. Uh, my state, I'm frankly shocked that they haven't done this already. Um, I'm hearing all sorts of different shit. I'm hearing that they've dropped the number down to 40%, which is still insane. Um, I've heard that it's 70%. I mean, as long as it's over 10%, it's fucking crazy. So, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm, I'm really, like, super stressed out from it. It's, it's, like, actually causing me a lot of stress. Um, and what's really causing me a lot of stress is that so many people just don't care. Like, so many people can be just, like, filling out these, these forms. They could be filling out these, you know, it takes a minute out of their day and they could be filling it out whether they're from Connecticut, whether they're not from Connecticut, it doesn't matter. They can just fill it out and put in a zip code that's a Connecticut zip code and it would help and so many people aren't doing it. And like, it doesn't matter who they are, it doesn't matter if they vape, it doesn't matter if they don't, you know, as long as they're not people that just like hate vaping, like anybody can do it. And like nobody's fucking doing it, and it, and it's and it's killing me. Like I said, I know of, I know of probably between like 40 and 50 people that I got to send in emails today. Uh, a lot of which aren't even from Connecticut, um, and there's just not enough people doing it, and that's all there is to it. Just not enough people are doing it. I have a vector. What am I doing with myself?
I'm talking to a woman right now who's a big advocate, and I'm trying to get her opinion. Um... Oh man, this is killing me, dude. This is really killing me. Let's put a point in there. Oh boy. Oh, I keep forgetting that I have this salted caramel. We'll be excited on Thursday, though, when my shit comes in. I'll be in a good mood on Thursday, I think. So long as they don't pass this uh, pr uh, this proposal on Thursday and hit us at 60%. As long as that doesn't happen, I'll be in a good mood on Thursday. AF, dude. Look at them all coming out over here. God damn. I guess I should have that trap on, huh? Jesus. Uh no, they're not. Well that's that's part of the problem, is that it's 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 partially big tobacco trying to get rid of vaping as much as they can. Uh, they're upping the the tax on cigarettes as they do every year, but they're only adding 35 cents to it And with with vaping they're adding So let's 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 count a bottle of juice to be equivalent to a pack of cigarettes Okay, let's do that. So they're adding um, Well, no, let's say let's say um, a bottle of juice is equivalent to like two packs of cigarettes, we'll say, okay? So with cigarettes, they're adding, so between two packs, they're adding basically 70 cents, give or take, whatever it ends up being. Um, and with the vaping, they're adding about $20. Or $15. So they're almost doubling it. All right. They're almost doubling it. That's 
awesome. Wow, that ammo does a lot more damage than I thought it did. Jesus. That's impressive. Alright, let's put point there, point there. Fill up our ammunitions. What up, school basher? How you doing, dude? Hey, get out of here, bruh. So why can't you jump on trap? There we go, what the fuck? I thought that was going to be it. I did my mouth wrong. What an idiot. That's alright. We good. We'll drop some armor and then we're good. Look at that. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. 
But yeah, so I see that we have uh, five viewers. If you five people would be interested in trying to help my state out, dude, it would help. Um, literally, all you have to do is fill in like six seconds worth of info, uh, put a Connecticut zip code in, and then it'll pull up a pre-written automated email. You hit send and you're done. It literally would take you like a minute, not even. Unless you're like compu completely illiterate to computers, then it might take you like two minutes. But other than that, it should literally take you 30 seconds to be done with it. I guess I might as well finish up my armor and then I'll work on my drone. It doesn't cost you anything, you don't gotta sign up for anything. Put the link in chat here. Hang on. Oh, god damn it. God damn it. Hang on, I fucked up. Um. That's the link. Just go there, fill out the info uh, for a zip code, put in like 06010 or something like that. Um, and then it's going to be like, oh yeah, here's an email, pre-written, submit it, done. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I've got if 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 this tax goes through, I've got something big planned. Um, I've I've got a big idea planned. Um, if it goes through, I'm I'm praying to God that it doesn't. But it, if it does, I've got a big idea. Um, I would have to find a lawyer though.
Oh, you bitch. But bam. The only downside, dude, the only downside to doing a, a picket is I don't know how many people will actually show up. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't know, you know, so many people are like, oh yeah, I would go. But like, how many of those people that say they'll go are actually going to show up? Do you know what I mean? Like, how many of those folks are really truthfully going to show up? That's that's where I kind of, like... I mean, I'll do it by myself, but, like, what does that prove having one person pick it? That, that does nothing. That, that, that completely accomplishes nothing at all. So, if it comes down to a picket situation, I'm going to need to have at least, like, 20 people go with me. God damn cryptic doesn't even let me send a message to somebody on Facebook. Ah oh, shit. Of course. Of course it's a Lieber, why wouldn't it be? Here, but I think he's up on this roof. Eh, 
Hey, thank you, CMC. Appreciate it, man. Wow, look at him. That was like a, that was like a cluster fudge right there. There's a cluster jam of scorpions up in there. trap is so OP. It's almost disgusting. What, what did it say not available about? Did you put in a Connecticut zip code like I said? What up J-Rock? How you doing? And what, what did it say, what was the exact message? Hey there. Ugh. That's that's weird. It's worked for everybody else. God damn it, god damn it. Oh boy. What what is going on here? Get up the stairs. Does it take no it doesn't. It's super easy to run ghosts on PC. It's like super easy. See, I don't think it is. I think it's totally fine. I, I have absolutely zero issues running this game, like, at all. Like, there's no weird hitches, no weird stutters, no weird glitches. Like, I've got zero issues with this game. Except for, like, that 91 FPS cap that they typically, you know, don't ever get rid of for some reason. In this game, it makes sense, because this was before the time of 144 Hertz games, but, like, Infinite Warfare has just 
straight up doesn't make any sense. Jammed up in a quarter, dude. Jesus Christ. Well, at least my fucking drone is doing work. It'll it'll be fine. Pretty much no matter what computer you like, you could probably buy some like just standard Dell PC these days and it'll run this game no problem. Like straight up. This shit is so easy. I mean, you got to remember, man, this game is old. Like it still looks good, but the technology involved, there's not there's not as much going on as it looks like there is. Not even a dedicated dude, like, um, this game is probably equally as intense, if not less intense, than, like, CSGO is to run, and my old fucking Dell all-in-one ran CSGO with zero issues. I mean, not maxed out, but, um, it ran at, like, pretty much pure medium settings, and it was no problem. 
I mean, if you've got, like, a, a decent computer with, a like, an okay, like, a fucking GTX 5 or 6 series, it'll, it'll fucking run it, guaranteed. Let's see, what are, what are the, what are the recommended on this game? I guarantee you it's, like, nothing. Um... Uh, recommended is Windows 7, 6 gigs of RAM, uh, a GeForce GTS 450. Yeah, pretty much anything these days will run it. When was that, though? How long ago was that? Like, I'll legit pull out my old Dell right now and try to run this game. That's fucking terrible. That's the worst thing I've seen all day. Oop, 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 probably not getting the gas. <laughs> oh, so a buddy of mine, he sends me these videos on Facebook, like, on a daily basis, and they're always, like, these hot-ass chicks, like, doing crazy shit, you know? And so he sends me this video, and he's like, bro, he's like, check out this girl. And I'm like, okay, here we go again. Oh, don't you fucking dare. Don't you dare, you fucker. So I'm like, alright, whatever. I'm like, it's another one of these fucking, you know, one of these crazy videos, sure. And, you know, and it start. there's like this chick who's doing all this sexy shit. She's like stark naked, you know. I'm like, alright, that's cool. I'm like, right on, right on, right on. And, uh, and then, and then she stands up. And, uh, and she's got this just obnoxiously, obnoxiously big tallywhacker. I mean, huge. <laughs> I'm like, dude. <laughs> like, really? Like, you, you had to, like, you had to do that to me, dude? Like, you're a fuck. Oh, that's, that's the worst thing I've seen in a long time. Yo. Ugh. 
Oh, that's 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 great. That's, that's just, I, I don't even know what to say about that, that's, that's so fucked up. <laughs> Fucking did it again, dude. He's like, nah, 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 but legit though. He goes, here, let me make up for it with this one. Fucking asshole, yo. Son of a bitch, dude. Unbelievable, man. Oh, god damn it. I'm so triggered right now, dude. Like, I'm like I'm so mad that all I can do is laugh. Fucking unbelievable, dude. Oh, hey, that's a rhino. So fucked up.
god. Oh shit. Get out of here. Alright, now she's gonna get fucking capped. She's about to get shot up. Unbelievable, dude. Uh, no, I've had no time to do anything. I honestly don't even have time to stream. I've got far more important things uh, that I should be doing tonight and not streaming. Like, for the last three weeks, that's how it's been. I I've had no time to do anything that I actually want to do. Like, at all. I've, I've taken a few nights off this week and, and you know, it's it's kind of like a double-edged sword because, like, if I, if I stream, I'm stressed out because there's other shit that I should be doing. And if I'm not streaming, um, you know, then I'm stressed out because I should be streaming. And, you know, if I'm streaming, I'm stressing out about, you know, you know, um, 
you know, the shit that I'm working on, and then if I, you know, or if I'm not streaming, I stress out about the, of, of what I'm working on and what I'm trying to get done. And then if I, if I'm actually, you know, if I, if I start streaming, then I'm stressing out because I know I should be working on it. I'm still stressing out about it. It's, it's like no matter what I do, I'm going to be stressed out as fuck. And, and it really fucking sucks. Only thing that I have to look for, if if something happens, um, if something happens where this guy that I've been talking to ends up shipping me something that's not what it's supposed to be, like if I for some reason, which I I'm like 99.99% sure that it's not gonna happen, but you know how things can go. If for some reason this the, this dude ends up beating me on this trade this week, I'm just gonna give up. Like, I'm straight up just gonna give up. Because, like, that's the only thing that I've got going for me this week. Is this trade. Well, no, it's not even that. Like, it's got, it's, 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 it's not even like remotely that. It's, 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 it's like other shit. Like, there's so much shit that's causing me so much stress right now that it's just, it's nothing, nothing is really helping. Like, at all. Like, there just, there's nothing that's like making things less stressful. And like, not only am I taking on shit that's way bigger than myself, um, you know, it, it, the fucked up thing is that like, there's people out there that I'm like trying to help. There's people that like I'm doing shit for that is stuff that isn't going to affect me at all, but I'm doing shit just to be nice. And it's taking up a lot of my time and it's taking up a lot of my money and I'm, you know, and it's like I'm trying to do everything all at once and like there's nobody who's helping me you know like I'm over here stressing the fuck out and all of these people that I'm doing all of this shit for are fucking doing nothing to help me out and like I've just I've got like no help in Connecticut I've got no support in Connecticut whatsoever I've got nobody helping me do what I've got to get done so I've got all this shit going on and it's like it's just on me to do it and it's really fucking taking a toll. And then on top of that, I got all this dumb shit going on at work. It, it's just, it's just, it's way too much. Like, there's just way too much going on, and I've got no fucking help at all. No, there's really not, and that's, that's what I'm saying. Like, a lot of it is shit that I need people in Connecticut to do. Like, there's shit that I need people locally to help out with. And none of them are like nobody's helping, and like, you know, I, I, I it, it's just out of control, dude. It, it really is. And like, I'm constantly trying to like keep up with how I've been and like shit that I've been trying to do for people, and like constantly giving this to somebody or helping somebody out with that or this and that. And it's and like I don't want anything in return, but if I'm like, you know, hey, dude, so like, you know. 
uh, you know, I know that you do this for a living. You know, is there any way that you could possibly take? And like, I never ask big favors of people. I don't do it. Like, if it's something small that's gonna take somebody three seconds, then like I'll ask. But like, I don't ever ask people to do shit to inconvenience that'll inconvenience themselves. Like, even if it's something that'll like really, really help me out. Even if it's something that will like really, really really do me a solid i don't ask because i don't want to inconvenience other people i inconvenience the shit out of myself just so i don't inconvenience others and so you know i i got all this shit that i'm trying to get done and like you know and there's something that's like really really irking me and i i can't i can't say it on stream but it's like really fucking pissing me off um and I, I don't know how to bring it up, but like, you know, there, there's just like, there's just, there's just so much. There's so much that's fucking irritating me and there's so much that's bothering me and like, you know, there's all these people like and all these groups on Facebook that I fucking help and like, you know, there's, there's this one guy that like a couple months ago, he, he was in like this whole like financial situation and I sent him like a hundred dollars worth of shit. And he, um, oh, what the hell does he do for a living? He, um, oh, what the fuck was it? What did I need him for? Um, um, fuck, what was it? Oh, I needed him to make me a, um, a header and a footer for an email address that I have. And it's sort of like a more professional email address. And, like, mind you, I gave this, I sent this dude, like, $100 worth of shit without even, like, asking. I just did it just to help him. And, uh, and then I'm like, hey, man, could you by any chance just, like, and it's something that I can do myself. I just don't have the extra five minutes to do it. And I'm like, hey, man, you know, like, if it wouldn't take too long, can you just, like, quickly whip up this, have it say this. I don't care if it, like, looks totally good or not, but just, you know something quick and and the dude is like ah oh. the guy's like well typically you know i i charge for that kind of thing and and i'm like I'm like how much do you charge and he's like oh I, I usually charge like 40 bucks but for you i'll do it for like 20. i'm like okay dude. like never mind man I'll, I'll just take care of myself you know, and, and like I, I, I specifically go out of my way to help a lot of people. Like the, like the amount of people that I help would blow your mind. And pretty much none of them help me back in in any way. And I don't want anybody to. Like I don't, I don't do shit for people expecting something in return. But if I do something for somebody and then I end up needing help, I, I, I kind of feel like the right thing to do is to help somebody out. Um, like, I feel like that's kind of the way that the world works. Like, if I help somebody, or if somebody helps me, and then they ask me for a favor, like, you better fucking believe that I'm gonna do my goddamn best to make that happen, no matter what it is. Like, you better fucking believe it. And it, it's just, it's just fucking, it's just out of control, dude. Like, it really is. And, like, and, and there's, there's some other shit that's got me, like, livid as F, dude. And I don't, I don't know how to bring it up because, like, it's kind of sensitive. Um, and I, I don't know how to talk about it, but, like, I really need to. Because, like, it's something that's been bothering me for uh, about a month and a half now. And then, as of, like, the last week, it's officially really pissed me off. Like, I'm really, truly pissed off now. Um, and, and I just don't know how... Uh, I just don't know how to bring it up. Oh.
But, yeah, so anyway, dude, I, I just got... Uh, a ton of shit I gotta sort out. That's basically what it is. Alright, I'm gonna drop this shit. Right here. Oh, there's a rhino. Dope. Pistol will help. What the fuck? I've never seen that. Does that happen every time? Oh, he's dead. That was, uh, easy. Damn. I don't, I don't know how I just won. He went down once. That was weird. That was really weird. I gotta run, guys. I got a bunch of work I gotta get done here. So, I hope y'all have a fucking awesome night. Have an awesome day tomorrow, man. And I will catch you all on the flip side. Peace.